The World Food Program, WFP, has hailed the 1.5 million U.S. dollars contribution that the government of Japan made to enhance nutrition response to 40,000 food insecure people in the Gambia. Dado Cham has more. The latest food security analysis estimated that 600,000 people in the Gambia are food insecure representing 30% of the population. The analysis showed that 114,000 men, women and children have been severely affected during the lean season period from June to August 2021. The ambassador of Japan to the Gambia, His Excellency Tatsuo Arya, hailed as commendable the partnership between the Gambia and World Food Program in designing and executing the food security project. He described the project as important in that it relates to human security in this critical time of the COVID pandemic. Ambassador Arid was speaking on Thursday during the presentation of consumables to the WFP. This is why Japan proposed two initiatives in that respect. One, Africa Health and Wellbeing Initiative, and two, Initiative for Food and Nutrition Security in Africa. Mm. At the occasion of the Titan 7 meeting last year in Japan. Already other speakers mentioned Japan will host the Tokyo Nutrition for Growth Summit on December 7 to 8 this year, which provides a historic opportunity to transform the way the world tackles the global challenge of malnutrition. WFP representative in the Gambia, Yasuore Sumura, acknowledged that the Japanese government's support came at a critical time when COVID pandemic dealt the hardest blow to household food security. That this contribution being recognized today came at a very critical time, the COVID-19 pandemic which started last year, has heavily affected socio-economic activities in the Gambia, as well as global and local supply chains. Food prices have increased even compared with last year. The poverty has increased, and the food security situation is the worst compared to the past five-year average. According to the latest card of harmonize food security analysis exercise, 600,000 people were estimated food insecure in the Gambia, 30% of the population. This year, the biggest windstorm in the Gambia's recent history hit all parts of the territory, damaging so many people's houses and livelihood. In this situation, the worst hit is always women and children in vulnerable households. We are therefore grateful for this contribution to save lives of the malnourished women and children. The WFP program officer, who doubles as the global body's nutrition officer, Dauda Samba, spoke about the project's objectives interventions. Is the title of the support from the government of Japan. Nutrition support to vulnerable malnourished women and children in the context of COVID-19 in the Gambia. This is important because we know nutrition um, finds it very difficult to raise funds, but the government of Japan have showed their commitment and willingness to work with the World Food Program. And indeed, you are aware that in December, the government of Japan will be hosting what we call the Nutrition for Growth Summit. There was a humanitarian summit as well. So government of Japan throughout the world have shown their interest in supporting food and nutrition security, especially in developing countries areas and mode of operation. Meanwhile, the WFP will, through this contribution, provide fortified foods to malnourished children under five, pregnant women, breastfeeding mothers, and mothers living with HIV and AIDS to address moderate acute malnutrition. WFP will also support nutrition education and awareness raising with a view to increasing the knowledge and skills of caregivers, mothers, adolescent girls, adolescent girls, households, and community leaders in best feeding practices. Reporting for Star TV News, I am Dado Chan.